Hello everyone, I'm Kevin Hand, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon XD. Let's say Coliseum, because, I don't know, this music reminded me of Coliseum more than it does XD. So, yeah, oh well. Anyways, today more battle CDs. The Rattata that roared! Can a level 5 prevail over a level 100? I don't know, I don't think that's very special, uh, post-Gen 4. Gen 3, it's a little more impressive, I guess. Because the focus section. Also, we didn't have that, uh, sturdy Aeron with Shell Bell and whatever the crap else it has. The one that is banned in some circles. Alright. Shuckle. And Rattata. So we want to start off with the Super Fang. To cut its attack. Cut its HP in half. Start using Bide. We want to use Toxic now. Storing energy, whatever. Okay. And use Substitute now. So that when it unleashes the energy, it won't be a problem. Substitute will just sponge up the attack. Or just not work at all, even. Now we want to Super Fang one last time. And I believe that should put it in low enough range where it gets killed by. Yeah, there we go. So that's that. Pretty easy, pretty straightforward. Pretty fun, though. Again, because you're. A level 5 Rattata taking down a level 100. Without using the whole Endeavor quick attack shtick that you would use in Generation 4 and beyond. Okay. So we get an Energy Root, which I don't really like using, but if you're into that sort of thing, then that's cool, I suppose. Oh, okay. So they expanded their collection that we can buy. Let's see, 25. Let's see, 26. And battle C, 30. Which means I believe we own everything up to 30 now. And even beyond. Uh, I'm not going to check for transfer anything. I assume that whenever they, uh... Whenever they ran, we'll just get a message if there's any more. I think there's one more uh, set that we so yeah, Farfetch is going to be using Substitute, and if it uses Flail, uh, you're probably going to die, so... want to watch out for that, and we only have an Inkata, so... Havoc! And... It's a good one. Uh, I don't know what to do with that one. Oh well. I'm not seeing a lot of female trainers here. We had that female bodybuilder earlier, but... I think it was mostly it. Kinda. Uh, I think we just want to use Fury Swipes. Because it'll break through its substitute, probably. And also continue attacking it beyond it. Substitute Do we get another hit in? Five hits, even. So, I think if we get one extra hit in, we should get there. So, can we get three hits off of Fury Swipes? Two. Substitutes to evade. One more hit. Yep, there we go. And that was another really easy one. Cool beans. Sure, I'll go with that one. So, 
would like to choose another one. This section's pretty interesting. Because you have four Pokémon, you will only use three. So, yeah. They have Mugman Ectric and Gengar. Gethard, sure. We have Wydon, Golem, uh, Swallow, and Flareon. I think Golem is the only one in that lineup that you can't actually get in this game. Kind of odd. Also, Gengar is one of the few Gen 1 Pokemon you can actually get in this game. And you do need Fire Riddle in Green 4. Alright, so. I'm gonna use Flamethrower on there, I believe. And then... Why is... actually... Uh, I think this is what we wanna do. It sounds stupid, but I think this is what we wanna do. Armor... Golem goes first. That's good. That's what I was hoping for there. Baron takes a pretty big hit from that. It's okay. Look faints. Okay, an action probably faints. Because it's not the one that had the defense boost up. So in one turn we take a three Pokemon. And seeing as I use uh oh, flamethrower on myself. I can now send that to Flareon to get a flash on our boost. So that's cool. And now, uh... One more. And overheat. Yes. Will-O-Wisp will help you out. I mean, I guess, but not really. He should probably take it out. And it did not yet. So I guess it's a good thing that I actually used Flamethrower with Ride on here. So I won anyways in two turns. Cool beans. This next battle is pretty funky as well. Okay. Let's see this burn heal. We'll choose another battle CD. Which is number 20. Yes. Back to the waste spoke spot we go. Lob of it and vein it. And we get Salamans and Dust Clubs. So Intimidate, let's go on. Salamans can do pretty much nothing. So. Let's get rid of it. I don't need it. Also, we only have four turns for this battle, so... Better make it quick. Oh, 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 delicious. I don't know why, but it always looks like... Those clubs doing that. I see it. So, Ice Beam and Salamence. Takes it out immediately. 
good. We should have enough turns to take care of him. I think we actually shot a punch there. That would have not been good otherwise. Guess I, I guess I planned that surprisingly well. I thought Houndoom would just be one shot again. I do like how you have to kill your own Salamance, though. That's pretty... It's pretty funny. Clear that one. Which means we've done two fifths of all the battle CDs right now. Get an awakening. We can at least uh, reach the halfway point in Battle CDs in this one. Is this the first three star mission? I don't know if any of the previous ones were three stars. This one certainly is. Dixie! Sure. We will, we will go with that one. And we're I think so far we've only seen the focus spots in ONBS for like two battles. So now we have Greyloom and Clefable. Uh, let's use Swallow and Swallow. And let's use Swallow Me. Yeah, too bad you can't fake me out anymore after I'm already taking you down. On using while well, we keep on using follow me. Hey, day, whatever. Coins scattered everywhere. They're absolutely everywhere. Critical hit on the swallow. That's a little bit overkill there. Oh well. faster on it, so it's okay. I guess you could take out Meow first, and then use Focus Punch with both Pokemon. Because Swallow would be sleep and Maggie would also use Focus Punch, but... Yeah, I don't think that one. I'll just use Focus Punch with both of them, whatever. Whoever he's gonna hit, uh, the other one will probably kill the focus punch. And yeah, 
150 super, 150 base power, super effective move. You aren't gonna love that. Alright, so. Beat Bixie. Which still isn't the name. Okay. Get, oh! Get a Focus Punch TM. That's pretty cool. I mean, probably not gonna use that, but it's, it's pretty cool. So, this battle, I didn't read what the title was, but uh, we have a Bayonet and a Plusle, and they have a Zangus and a Gyarados. A Bondo. Go with that one. So, I believe they'll lead off with Gyarados. Which, what Slash does is, waits for the target to make a move. If they use a boosting move, you'll snatch it. Which means you'll take it for your own. Uh, I could also use Psych Up, just copy them, but snatching them is a force of fun. So, we want to do this for three or four turns or something like that. I'm gonna do four just to save, so it's two. Right. It's not for right. third turn. Yeah. See, in the meantime, uh, We've cured up our Intimidate, and we've reached, and we're gonna reach three extra attack boosts as well. There. Dragon Dance. At this point, we're also at plus four speed, so. Yeah, we're, we're pretty, we're pretty strong here. Alright, so. Now, what we wanna do is we wanna use Shadow Ball. To knock this thing out. Oh. Or not. Yeah, but he's gonna just use Dragon Mounts again. At plus 4 speed, I think I'm still faster than that. Yeah, you just think just has Dragon Mounts. I don't know. Oh boy. That's not good. But I still managed to outspeed it, so it makes it okay. Alright. Get rid of those down. Send some of this I believe I just want to use Grudge here. Because he's going to knock me out of the Shadow Ball. And I think this will make me take away all the Shadow Ball. we have Plusle, who, he for some reason, get in a lot of battles. He's in two, in our two battles, uh, we're apparently getting another Plusle as well. Sword Defense, which I'm going to use in color. On. So, let's do so. And let's use Charge and Thunder Shock to things even get thunder shock? I don't even know. Okay, 
that's going really slow. Oh, shit. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. What? That's not at all what... Hmm. Come on. That's not cool. Yes, I'm on battle again. Do you have to charge multiple times? I didn't know that. use it five times to just knock him out of one head. Because apparently this guy never learns and never bothers to switch to anything else. Too bad you can't use the snatch strategy on the Zangos. Tells you that now Encore is ended. Unlike what move was that? Like taunt. I think not ending in a battle I did in one of the other games. I don't remember the exact specifics of that. Oh yeah, the Latios battle, that's right. It not ending telling me that taunt ended in like a bunch of times. This battle is a lot more fun in theory than it actually is. Attack so rose again. And we didn't reach the halfway point in the battle CDs in this video, sadly. Oh well. I mean, hey, I'm actually doing gameplay. And it didn't kill, really. is, does an extra charge boost my Thundershock more? I don't know how exactly that works. She's a grudge. Like a single charged thunder shock is not good enough. That's for certain. <laughs> and once he finishes these sword stances, he's gonna kill me. So that's not. If 
If it would have given me any stronger move, then I would have been fine. Will this be enough? I guess I'll have to say. Oh, yeah, that's of course. That's of course fantastic. again. I think that's what I want to do. This ended, but now I can do it again. Okay. That's what you're supposed to do. I'm sorry, I'm stupid. That's what I figured, but for some reason I didn't do it. everybody's time now. Okay, another thermal shock. Does that finish you off, or does that... I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> Alright, so there we go. It took way too long, but we beat it. So that's, that's good. Now let's just get the Snatch TM for this. <laughs> It's like, oh, you like this move? It's like, no, I don't really. Thanks, so, yeah, I'll totally use this. Okay. Ooh, rare candy. That's really nice. So, with that, I'm gonna thank you guys all for watching, I'll see you guys all next time, when we'll do Battle CD 23 and beyond. So, for now, bye.